Yeah, these uh, kind of futuristic uh, structures basically uh, cover uh, geothermal uh, boreholes. And uh, specifically here on this site, uh, we uh, re-inject CO2 and H2S, greenhouse gases, produced by the geothermal power plant into uh, the, the geologic subsurface for permanent storage. We are basically standing on really exciting rock, uh, so-called basaltic rocks. It's a volcanic rock, rich in calcium magnesium. And these gases react with this rock and basically enable us to convert that CO2 gas back into limestone, which is calcium carbonate. So it is permanent storage and it cannot leak out of the ground back into the atmosphere. We will recover 200 meters of core from the injection reservoir and we are basically looking if we find our uh, carbonated CO2 in this rock course. The model actually predicted that uh, the CO2 would turn into rock within approximately five years of injection. And actually at that time no one believed the model, said it was outrageous, there's no way it can happen this quickly, but then it turns out it happened even faster as pretty much all was mineralized within one year. We think that our method can be applied elsewhere uh, in our fight against global warming and climate change.